China is reshaping the future of space exploration with the upcoming debut of its Long March 12th rocket, a groundbreaking innovation set to redefine commercial spaceflight. This isn't just another rocket launch. It's the first from the brand new Hainan International Commercial Aerospace Launch Center, a facility designed exclusively for commercial missions. With its advanced design, unmatched payload capacity, and strategic launch site, the Long March 12th represents a monumental leap in rocket technology. In this video, we'll explore what makes this rocket special and why this launch matters on a global scale. The Long March 12th rocket represents a groundbreaking advancement in China's space exploration capabilities, setting a new benchmark in rocket design and efficiency. Developed by the Shanghai Academy of Spaceflight Technology, this two-stage rocket features a significant structural upgrade with its 3.8-meter diameter, surpassing the standard 3.35-meter diameter found in most Chinese rockets. This wider design allows for greater propellant storage, enabling the Long March 12th to carry heavier payloads and undertake more ambitious missions. Standing at over 60 meters tall, the rocket is powered by six liquid oxygen kerosene engines, a critical innovation for its enhanced performance. The first stage is equipped with four IF-100 engines, each generating a thrust of 1,250 kilonewtons, while the second stage features two IF-115 engines with 180 kilonewtons of thrust each. This propulsion system is an evolution of China's new generation of liquid propellant engine technology, emphasizing efficiency, reliability, and power. It enables the Long March 12th to transport up to 10 metric tons to low Earth orbit or 6 metric tons to a sun-synchronous orbit at an altitude of 700 kilometers. Another standout feature of the Long March 12th is its advanced ignition malfunction detection system. This safety mechanism ensures that any anomalies detected after ignition can halt the launch sequence, minimizing risks during critical pre-launch moments. This system reflects China's commitment to improving the reliability and safety of its rockets, addressing a vital aspect of successful launches. The rocket's innovative design optimizes its length to diameter ratio, which enhances its aerodynamic stability, particularly during high velocity phases. This design improvement addresses previous limitations in rocket stability and sets the stage for advancements like reusable rockets in the future. By refining these dimensions, the Long March 12th achieves a higher level of control during launch, making it a key step in China's pursuit of cost-effective and sustainable space exploration. With these capabilities, the Long March 12th isn't just another rocket. It's a symbol of China's growing sophistication in aerospace technology. The Hainan International Commercial Aerospace Launch Center is more than just a launch facility. It represents a strategic leap forward for China's space industry. Located in the coastal city of Wenchang in Hainan Province, this state-of-the-art spaceport is the first in China to focus exclusively on commercial operations. Its establishment marks a shift in China's space program toward greater integration of private enterprise, allowing commercial ventures to flourish alongside government-led initiatives. Construction of the launch center began in July 2022 and progressed at a remarkable pace. By December 2023, the number one launch service tower was operational, tailored specifically for the Long March 8th rocket. In June 2024, the number two tower was completed, designed with versatility in mind. This tower can accommodate over 10 types of liquid propellant rockets, including the Long March 12th and other privately developed models. This adaptability ensures the launch center can support a wide range of missions, from satellite deployments to exploratory probes. One of the facility's standout features is its coastal location, which offers unique logistical and operational advantages. Transporting large rocket components by sea becomes significantly easier, reducing costs and complexities compared to overland transport. Additionally, its proximity to the equator provides a natural boost to rockets during launch, as Earth's rotation imparts additional velocity. This advantage is particularly valuable for geostationary satellites, which require precise positioning relative to Earth. The Hainan Center is a joint venture involving the Hainan Provincial Government and three state-owned enterprises China Aerospace Science and Technology Corp., China Aerospace Science and Industry Corp., and China Satellite Network Group. 
This partnership underscores the collaborative effort to expand China's space infrastructure while fostering commercial participation. The facility's design and capabilities also reflect a broader vision of making space access more inclusive and economically viable. By lowering barriers for private companies to launch satellites and conduct research missions, the center promotes innovation and growth in China's burgeoning space industry. The debut of the Long March 12th and the operational launch of the Hainan International Commercial Aerospace Launch Center symbolize a new era for China's space program, one that focuses heavily on the commercialization of space exploration. This transition is not just a technical achievement, it represents a strategic realignment of China's role in the global space economy. By prioritizing commercial missions, China is aligning itself with a growing trend where private enterprises drive innovation and profitability in space. One of the most significant aspects of this development is its potential to challenge the dominance of established spacefaring nations like the United States and European Union. With the ability to launch larger payloads more efficiently, China positions itself as a competitive provider of satellite deployment services. This is particularly important as the demand for satellite constellations, used for everything from internet connectivity to climate monitoring, continues to rise. By offering cost-effective solutions, China could attract international clients, boosting its space-related revenue and global influence. From a geopolitical perspective, this move strengthens China's hand in the race for space dominance. By building a dedicated commercial launch facility, China signals its commitment to fostering a thriving private aerospace sector, similar to how companies like SpaceX and Blue Origin have transformed the U.S. space landscape. The Hainan Launch Center's capacity to accommodate rockets from private developers underscores this intent, paving the way for a more dynamic and competitive domestic space industry. On the technical front, the Long March 12th lays the groundwork for future advancements, including reusable launch vehicles. Its optimized design addresses key challenges in rocket recovery, such as stability and control during re-entry. This focus on reusability is crucial for reducing launch costs and ensuring sustainable exploration. Additionally, the rocket's advanced safety systems, such as the ignition malfunction detection feature, set new standards for reliability, which is essential for attracting commercial clients. The long-term implications of this development are vast. For China, it represents a step closer to achieving its broader space ambitions, including lunar exploration and interplanetary missions. For the world, it highlights the growing accessibility of space as more nations and private entities gain the ability to participate in space exploration. The upcoming launch of the Long March 12th from the Hainan International Commercial Aerospace Launch Center represents a milestone in China's space endeavors. This event showcases significant technological advancements and underscores China's commitment to integrating commercial operations into its space program. As China continues to innovate and expand its capabilities, it is poised to play an increasingly influential role in the global space industry, driving forward both technological progress and international collaboration. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on space exploration and scientific discoveries. And don't forget to leave a comment below. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.